Kevin and I walked right past it and Everett said, oh, what's that? <laughs> Great spot. Look at that snake. Oh my goodness, that is awesome. All right, guys, I am out here this morning uh, hiking in South Florida with uh, Kevin Price, uh, SoCal Rattler on Instagram, right? Yep. And, uh, and also with Everett, um, Evo's Wildlife on Instagram. And we are out here this morning in South Florida um, hiking in some nice cool weather, hoping to see some snakes out basking. Um, it's an absolutely beautiful day. Um, and I think it's it's really good conditions to see stuff out basking So we're gonna get after it and see what we can find and I got a good feeling about today All right guys, we just hiked up on our first snake of the day little pygmy rattlesnake spotted by Everett There he is just basking. Well, I guess he's not even really basking because he's not in the Sun But he's kind of coiled up there in an ambush position on that log right along the edge of some very, very thick forest slash mangrove swamp. First snake of the day, great to be on the board. We'll see what else we can find. All right guys, so here's Kevin doing his thing. He's got a really, really cool camera setup here that I've never seen anyone use before, but it's quite ingenious. And uh, he's getting some in C2 shots of this little pygmy rattlesnake here. You can see he's using a little bit of a flash to fill in the shadows. Really, really cool setup. Make sure you go follow him on Instagram. So this is our second snake of the day. This is an Everglades racer. Sitting out basking in the sun on this cool morning. And it's a really nice specimen. Second snake of the day. It comes out in a bunch All right, of so right just, shed. this is our, is this our second or third shed of the morning? Uh, second. Second? second? Yeah, so the second shed of the morning. Another racer shed. It's pretty obvious because he's got smooth scales and no pattern. So lots of snakes and snake evidence around this morning. Hopefully we'll see a few more. All right, so we just hiked up on our third, no. We're up to more than that now. I think this is five because we've missed a couple of racers that have darted off. So this is, I think, snake number five. Second pygmy rattlesnake of the day. Kevin and I walked right past it and Everett said, oh, what's that? <laughs> Great spot off the trail. And uh, he's looking a little bit skittish like he wants to run away, but we're going to try to get a few quick photos of him. He's actually got a really nice string on him. All right, guys, here's one more look at this really big dusky pygmy rattlesnake we just found. And uh, we got some photos of him. He was being a little bit uncooperative, so we decided just to call it and let him go back on his way. Really cool snake. And look at the size of that rattle. That is a huge rattle for a pygmy rattlesnake. Really, really cool. back into the wild where they belong. All right guys, we were just hiking along and talking about herping and uh, I just happened to notice this really 
a good sized Brooks King snake basking in the grass at the side of the road. And um, man, that's cool. How's it going? Hey, I like keep saying that. All right, so I think this is the exact same snake that we s found last week. There he is, right there. There he is. Yeah. Yeah. Do you want to grab him? Yeah. Yeah. There he is. Yeah, that's the same snake we found last week. So he's doing okay so far. He's still out basking. There he is. Beautiful, beautiful snake. I'm gonna get around to the other side where the light's better. Brooks King Snake. Any day that you see a Brooks King down here is a good day. Look at that snake. All right, guys, we're just hiking along. And uh, man, we hadn't seen a snake in a little while, maybe just a racer. And this big old diamondback is sitting out right along the edge, basking in the sun, just like exactly like we thought they'd be on a cool day like today. Look at that snake. Oh my goodness, that is awesome. It's probably, at, it's at least three feet long, if not longer. Can't see the rattle yet. But what a great looking snake. That is amazing. We're gonna try to get some photos and videos of this guy, if we can. And, uh, <laughs> that right there, that's, that makes the day, for sure. That's a great maker. Wow. What do you think, Kevin? Life or Diamondback? Oh, yeah. How are you feeling? It's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. I mean, like, you can tell, like, obviously, this is not, by Diamondback standards, it's not, you know, a particularly big one. Yeah. But, like, you could just see, like, the girth of them from yeah. like, the, the length. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. That's a that's an impressive snake, even though it's not super long. That's better. Well, I need some editing, but so we got some photos and videos of this snake, this absolutely amazing Eastern Diamondback, and now we're just gonna let him crawl back off right where we found him into his really cool mangrove swamp habitat. Look at this guy, beautiful, beautiful snake, so incredible! What an awesome, awesome uh, highlight of this outing today in South Florida. And look at him, once he gets into this brush, he just starts to disappear. Isn't that cool? So, so cool. Yeah, man. Yes. That's, that's so cool. Yeah. Thank you so much. Safe travels, guys. Thank you. Thank you, you too. All right, guys, we just hiked up on our third pygmy rattlesnake of the day, um, spotted by Eagle Eye Everett. And look at that cool little position he's basking in right there. Well, not even basking, he's just, just, hanging, out just hanging out. Very, very cool. my settings for that before. <laughs> All right, here's Everett and Kevin getting some shots, some NC2 shots of this pygmy rattlesnake. 
really, really great spot by Everett. And just, uh, it's in such a cool position sitting on this like really thick vine right on the edge of the trail. I'm zoomed in and it's still hard to see. Very cool. I'm gonna try a flash. I'm gonna try a little, oops. Guys, thanks so much for watching. What an amazing day out in the field. I still can't believe how awesome it was and all the species we got to see and uh, just a great day out there. Make sure you go follow Everett and Kevin on Instagram. Uh, I'll put the links to their pages down in the description below. Um, they see lots of cool stuff, lots of great photos. You won't be disappointed. Thanks guys for tuning in. See you guys next time.